My name is Federico Gomez Suarez. I'm originally from Puebla, Mexico. Most of my family are engineers, but they are engineers who do things with their hands. Uh, I turn out to be an engineer who codes. I write software which scans images, looking for bad images, images that we know are illegal. I work very closely with organizations like the National Center for Missing Children. At the end of the day, the kind of content that we work on is content we just don't want to have online. And we are impacting the people who have been affected by that content by just making sure it doesn't get distributed again. When I was about 12 or 13, there was a research lab close to where I used to live. It turned out that they needed someone who could code. I really couldn't code at the time, but I said, oh, I'll do it. I'll work on this for the summer. So I started working at the lab and I had there my book of C language that I was just reading through, trying to learn how to move this little engine. And it took me forever to just figure it out, but eventually it worked. And I just enjoyed doing it. I would stay late at night until I started working and I realized that that was something I really liked doing. When I was my freshman year in Mexico, in a small school, I decided I wanted to work for any of the big companies in the US. So I sent my resume to every company I knew and I didn't hear anything for a year. All of a sudden I got an email saying Microsoft was coming to recruit and I prepared, went all in and I didn't pass the first interview. But they saw that I was so passionate about doing something with code that they interviewed me the next year. And after that, I ended up coming here to Microsoft. To solve a real life problem is not only about the code. The code is a piece of it, but you need to think about the whole ecosystem. And Microsoft has people who have expertise on all these different areas. So I meet with lawyers, I meet with business analysts, I meet with different people in the company to be able to understand the problem better and together try to really find a solution. Usually I, I spend the mornings, meetings and do that kind of work and then in the evening I just put my headphones on and just start coding. Find something that you're passionate about, like a problem in the world that you think is important and, I, and then look how you can partner with nonprofit or find people who are already working there and help them. You know, use your skill, use your passion, use your energy to help solve a problem. You will realize that you can bring a lot to the table. Come up with new ideas on how you can have impact. Just keep knocking doors. Eventually, one does open.